Welcome to the Breas Vivo 45 LS tutorial series. In this video, we will be going through the features and functionality of the right hand panel. Behind the right hand panel, you will find the air inlet filters as well as the slot for the SD card. To remove the panel, you have to first lift the handle and next push the grey button down to release the side panel. As you can see, there are two filters within this compartment. The grey carbon inlet filter is for filtering large particles and must always be in place when treatment is running. It is recommended that the filter be replaced every 12 months and that it is checked and washed at least once a week. Please reference the user or clinical manual for cleaning instructions. The white inlet filter is for filtering small particles. It is recommended that the filter be changed at least every 30 days or more frequently when used in high pollution or pollen rich environments. The white filter should be inserted first over the air inlet with the black filter positioned as the first point of contact for the air. The Vivo 45 LS has 365 days worth of internal memory. No external card or memory device is required to be in place during normal operation. The SD card port is to facilitate the transfer of internally stored information to a separate SD memory card. As an alternative, Vivo 45 LS data can also be transferred with a USB cable from the back side of the ventilator. This transferred data can be used with the Breas PC software for detailed analysis, decision making and report generation. This concludes the right panel tutorial for the Breas Vivo 45 LS. For more information, please visit the Education by Breas website. Thank you for watching.